Hi, I'm Dr. Bertice Perry, and I want to tell you a story. When my son was a little boy, he would make up songs for everything. He would read the signs and sing the songs. He didn't talk, but he did sing. And when I was a child, they say, before I spoke, I sang. But my son did that, and he would make up these songs. And one of his most famous tunes was whenever we were in a car. He didn't want to go from point A to point B. He wanted to go from point A to I'm there. And he'd get in the car and he'd just say, start singing. Gotta get there, gotta get there fast, gotta get there, gotta get there fast, gotta get there, gotta get there fast, gotta get there. For however long we were riding. If we were riding from Savannah to Delaware, which is 10 hours, gotta get there, gotta get there fast, gotta get there, gotta get there fast, gotta get there, gotta get there fast, gotta get there. For 10 hours. His daughter, my granddaughter, now makes up songs and she has a famous tune that annoys everybody um apparently one day her mother was putting one of her masks on and she broke the elastic on the mask now this was not a mask that i made it was a mask someone else gave her and the elastic broke and so elena made up a song that she calls her pretty so sad song and she's fine and she says, Mommy broke the mask all the time, 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 to time, to time, time, to time. All the time, 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 to time, to time, time, to time. And I love that song. And I sing that song over and over and over again. And I annoy everybody with her song. Because that's a grandmother's prerogative. I love having this long view of life to see not only my children grow up, but watch as my grandchildren are growing up and to see the same things come back around and some come back around with a new twist. She also has a song, it's just a different song. None of my children sang about masks because they didn't have to wear masks. They didn't live through a global pandemic. And I'm really hoping that we stop singing my son's song, Gotta Get There Fast, because we're rushing back into a life that didn't keep us from the first pandemic. I'm hoping we stop singing that song, Gotta Get There, Gotta Get There Fast, Gotta Get There, Gotta Get There Fast. I'm hoping that my granddaughter, when she's grown and has grandchildren of her own, I remind them about her song and they look at me and say, what's a mask? I'm hoping that. I'm hoping that my great-grandchildren never have to go through a pandemic and have to have the experience of somebody breaking the mask all the time, 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 to time, to time, time, to time. I'm hoping that we learn the lesson this time. And then unlike that dual pandemic of systemic racism that has never gone anywhere, that just keeps waking up other people's awareness because it was always there. We're just seeing it more and more. I'm hoping that when my grandchildren are grown, they say, what's a mask? What was systemic racism? What are you even talking about? My fear though, my deep fear right now, is that because we're not doing our inner work, we want to rush out and somehow looking good on the outside makes everything okay on the inside. It does not. We don't have to get there fast. And we don't have to break the mask all the time. We can grow we can learn, we can evolve, but keep singing songs. I love you.